Hello, fe <coughs> excuse me. Hello, fellow YouTubers. Welcome. Uh, well, welcome to my uh, video that I'm going to be talking about uh, my series that I'm making. Um, as you could see, I already released the first episode of the of the series. Um, Sam, Sam and Centauri, the the protectors of Sazville. Um, well, um, as you could see, the first, the first episode I created, the first episode, um, was basically titled Sam and Centauri's Adventure, but, um, <clears throat> I decided to change it because, eh, it didn't really seem awesome you know I just want to change the title and that's why I did so instead instead of Sam and Centauri's adventure it's uh, Sam and Centauri the protectors of Sazville because <clears throat> that's what they are um, I was planning to release this video after I finished my second video uh, my second uh, episode of it because this video will have some spoilers um, so warning so um, I'll put like a warning somewhere in the in the video around here to tell you which uh, time frame I'm gonna be giving out the spoiler so uh, yeah um, so uh, let me uh, start talking to you guys about my characters. Um, but before I do, um, so you guys knew, oh, most of you, yeah, you guys knew that I was making, trying to make a a, uh, a fan series of My Little Pony, but it didn't go so well. I mean, I've tried. I tried to make it, but it's just, it's just, um, my, my fan fictions are a little bit more, I don't know how to say it, too much action-y than friendship be or whatever you want to call it, so, um, that's the reason why I had to drop it, and not only that, there was also a bunch of copyright issues going on, and other bullshit so <clears throat> that's the reason why I had to uh, drop the drop the My Little Pony series uh, the fan the fan series I'm gonna say the My Little Pony fan series series that I was creating um, I had to drop it because a um, bunch of copyright issues um, some of my art styles of ponies were not all that good and I see I need is the whole time growing community getting a man up getting uh getting pissed off at me so <laughs> don't want that. Um so uh yeah. And another thing, Hasbro has been you know, being mean to some bronies, so that's the reason why I had to drop it as well. Um so yeah. So Sam and Centauri they're um uh, Basically, they are the main characters of my uh, of my series. I mean, no, duh. Their name is in their names are in the in the title, so they have to be the main characters. I mean, come on now. <laughs> but um, yeah. Um. So let's talk about uh, Sam. Let's talk about Sam first. Uh, Sam Samuel. Uh, Samuel James, that's his full name, Samuel James, well, Samuel Fuzzy James, that's his name, Samuel Fuzzy James, and the reason why, he's a bunny, his name, his name's gonna have to have fuzzy in it, he has, he has to be fuzzy, or fluffy, so I decided to put fuzzy in it, because he's a bunny, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so, Sam, Samuel the bunny, or, um, was a um, 
was a uh, farmer of a poor family. They, um, I, I wouldn't say poor, but they were a farming family. Um, what they did was basically, what they do are basically they farm wind. Yeah, it's a wind farm or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. They use, uh, they have a bunch of uh, windows and stuff to, uh, to make power and stuff. It's a uh, wind farm or something like that. And, um, <clears throat> yeah. That's, um, basically on the other side of Sazville. And, yes, it's the same Sazville that I created in, um, in Halo. Except, ex in the Halo Forge, except, um, this one is much bigger. It has more buildings, it has stores, it even has a school. I mean, that Sam and Centauri are currently going to, and yeah, yada. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so Sam, he's a he was from that family that farmed wind. Um, he didn't really had a farming accent because um, because um, he wasn't original born. He wasn't originally born on the farm. He was originally born in a uh, in a different uh, city. Um, a, a city known as New Alexandria, and not the same one from uh, from Reach. Uh, it was from a different world, a different world called New Alexandria. Uh, but uh, yeah, he was from New Alexandria, and he uh, moved in with his. Uh, uncle and his uncle Travis and aunt um, Mary so uh, yeah so the bunny family basically both um, uh, farm wind to make power for the whole entire for the whole entire town of Zazville and um, Zazville was basically <clears throat> was basically founded by uh, by um, General Saz himself, um, one of the one of the um, he's one of the Super Warrior Three, um, the Super Warrior Trio, um, the people that in that's in Super in the Super um, Warrior Trio is uh, Spartan Larry. That um, General Zaz and and um, and Mike once and yes, if you guys heard those names, you know where those names came from. So don't uh, if, you, if you ever heard those names, yes, that's where those names came from. Um, I'll talk more about those characters later. And then uh, so yeah. <clears throat> Um, now Centauri is a different uh, character. Um, she wasn't born on the farm, nor a city. She was born in um, in um, in Sazville. She she's a she is a uh, a natural born. She's a natural born uh, Sazville citizen. Um, but. Uh, she was uh, orphaned when she was three years old after her uh, parents were killed during a uh, during a um, during the war between uh, the Covenant and the, between the between the Covenant and the, and the Spartans while they were uh, evacuating this planet known as um, known as um, Carlos, a planet, a planet called Carlos, um, Carlos B, <laughs> that's the name of the planet, so, um, yeah, um, they were, um, trying to get off Carlos B, but the Covenant ship shot him down, and there was no survivors, um, this, the Spartan, the Spartan, um, team took him out, and, Dug them out and um, took them to their rest, final resting place in Zazville. So uh, yeah, um, Centauri has been alone, has been 
growing up with a mother and a father for um, all the way until she was 16 and that's basically her her age right now her age is 16 and um, so is uh, so is uh, Sam well Sam's uh, one year older than her so he's uh, he's 17 going on 18 and uh, so I guess two years older <laughs> so uh, yeah uh, so Samuel is uh, seven, 17 years old and Centauri is 16 and um, so um, Centauri was uh, basically raised by her um, by her Aunt Jessie and her um, grandma grandma Baku and yes um, and yes um, it, it has to she has to have one of those names because it's an anime I mean come on all animes have to have those kind of names <laughs> so yeah um, so yeah her aunt Baku um, I mean her grandma Baku so uh, yeah and um, then um, she didn't meet Sam until she was in Eighth grade, that's when Sam and uh, Centauri met, and um, they were friends. And then they became an item. They became boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, so yeah. But then um, here comes the spoilers. All right. Well, in the first episode that I have released. You seen Sam laying on the ground with Centauri crying, but you didn't know what happened to Sam, and and what happened because you know I want to put everything, all all the details in part two, aka episode two. So uh, yeah, I mean all 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 shows and. All shows in uh, many different state TV stations and and other um, you know and movie stations and whatever you want to call them uh, the, the movie people that makes the stuff like um, like uh, DreamWorks, uh, Pixar, Disney, um, Hasbro, and other companies that make uh, cartoons. They always uh, they always you know make two parters and they don't give out the whole story until the second part, which sometimes do get annoying. Um, oh, in Disney XD and Cartoon Network, but that that. <laughs> so yeah. So um, yeah, as I was saying. Um, so um, yeah. So what happened? There was basically Centauri and Sam were basically heading to uh, school and their first day of school, well, first day of high school, and um, well, I wouldn't say first day of high school, uh, the first uh, the first day of junior, yeah, first day of junior, uh, junior year of high school. So uh, yeah. Sophomore. No, let's make a sophomore. Yeah, sophomore, sophomore year. I haven't, I haven't written the second, the second episode yet. So that's, <clears throat> that's another thing. I'm also just brainstorming too. So uh, yeah. <clears throat> so now all of this is going to be spoilers, but this, some of it is, but some of it's not. But um, yeah, they're going to be heading to uh, the sophomore year, and then um. While they were walking to the school, there was a freaky uh, lightning storm. Well, a freaky uh, charge of lightning. It hit a branch, and the branch hit Centauri in the head, and she was knocked out cold. And when she was knocked out cold, she wasn't. She she went into the dream world, and she did not know she was in the dream realm until um, 
until she got done fighting Jackson or aka okay, Johnson or you guys could call him Jackson or Johnson he goes by either name so uh, yeah after that uh, she met Spartan Larry Spartan Larry told her that she was in the dream realm and she asked him why he was in a dream realm and he was looking for his comrades that's the reason why um, so his comrades um, General Saz and Mike Wentz they were basically uh, captured by by uh, Gorgons and um, Larry, Spartan Larry has to go through a bunch of um, bunch of realms just to find them but he needs to go through the dream realm first so he could try to get a pinpoint of their location and once he finds the pinpoint he's gonna head to that world and this is gonna be uh, this is gonna be the episode when um, when Centauri and Sam helps him out. Centauri and Sam will help him out to find Once TV. I mean, not Once TV. Ugh. Um, Mike Once and says uh, General Saz. And once they uh, once they find them, they'll get them out. And yeah, and make them and save them. <laughs> so uh, yeah. Okay, so let's go back to uh, Sam and Centauri. My favorite, my favorite thing is to, my favorite thing to do while I'm doing this series is basic voice acting. It's, it's fun. It's really fun. I like it. Um, so the fun thing about this series is basically, is basically I get to voice act all the characters like Sam and Centauri. Centauri. Centauri! Uh. Okay. One eye man. The name is Spartan Larry. I know. Is real. Is one eye man really gonna be my new Especially name? Sam, Sam is. Sam uh, is the funny guy. I miss being called Jackson or Johnson. Oh. Uh. Um, Centauri is gonna be all. Uh, well, Centauri is basically like Pinkie Pie and Fluttershy mixed together. So, if you, if there's any Bronies out there, and if there's a Fluttershy and a Pinkie Pie mixed together, that's what Centauri is. So, yeah, you probably know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but don't worry, she doesn't know. She doesn't. Um, she does she doesn't um, affect her own physics much <laughs> um, but she does but she does have the gift to talk to animals so and party actually she's very she's very social and she likes to talk to animals so basically yeah um, so uh, yeah and you guys already know what uh, Centauri's and, and Sam's actual outfits are. Sam is the green shirt with blue pants. And Centauri is the black leather jacket with, with a half sleeve right here. And uh, dark blue jeans with, uh, with um, Converse boots or Converse boots or Converse boots or whatever you guys want to call them. I, they're the converse, but they're boots. I, I don't know. <laughs> and then she also has that pink shirt with the with the tornado with the twister in the middle of it, which I think is badass. <laughs> and also she has the lightning bulb on her uh, on her on her hair. Um, her uh, she it's a lightning bulb barrage or something like that. Yeah, lightning bulb lightning bulb barrage, a barrage or something. So uh, yeah, the uh, reason why she wears it is because her mother gave it to her when she was three and she never uh, part she never parted with it. She had it with her the whole entire time. 
So basically, that that barrette, yeah, barrette. That's what it's called, a barrette. So the barrette that she wears under her head is basically a um, is basically a um, only piece that she has of her fam, of her of her uh, parents before they, you know, went bye bye during the human and covenant war. Yeah, not fun. <laughs> but uh yeah and then um I would like to talk more about these other characters but I haven't created I haven't drawn yet so so um you guys will not be able to see what they look like like uh General Saz and and uh, Mike once for instance I didn't draw them yet I'm going to start drawing them soon, um, including, uh, including Master Ezio too. Master Ezio is going to be, uh, is going to be, it's going to be in it too, and, but we'll talk about that later. Um, Master Ezio will, will make his appearance in, I think, episode 3 or episode 4. I think episode 4. All depends. Um, so yeah, but I will give you. Uh, but I will give you this uh, one hint, though. I think episode four will be the Halloween special. I think so. Yeah, number f uh, episode four will be the Halloween special. The episode three will be something. I don't know. I had to brainstorm. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, but, um, but yeah, um, so the reason why I decided to do this is because, well, I'll tell you, my, my dream, oh, well, when I started, uh, when I first, you know, started school back way way back when I was in first grade when I even when I even when I start when I before I even started uh, kindergarten I always dreamt to be a construction worker one day so I so I studied hard day and night just to become a construction worker well unfortunately in uh, seventh grade I found out that I had asthma and it became really bad over years. I cannot be around dust and I can't be in very high heat, which sucks. So I had to drop drop that dream job and yeah, it was hard. But um, after I after I realized I like to create things, I decided to, you know, create a uh, these two characters and Tori and Sam and I was like hmm maybe I should make a series of these characters and that's why I did um but how did I but how did I have this um how did I um was inspired to do this well I was inspired by uh, Joey O Joey O inspired me inspire me to uh, not give up and and do what I really like to do to create and and I knew being a construction worker was not a good idea so I decided to create in a different way like animating I'm gonna be uh, after my uh, four paychecks I'm gonna try try to some uh, college uh, for animation and hopefully I pass college for animation and this series this series will no longer be an auto audio drama this will be an actual uh, animated series and yes yeah, probably just gonna be me doing all the voice acting and doing all the music like I'm doing right now um, so uh, yeah the first time when I saw Joey O was the first time I seen his first video well in that first video but uh, when I seen um, 
Pony Meets World. Uh, season 1 and Season 2. When I seen Pony Meets World, I fell in love with it. It was, it was a great series that he created, even though it ended at Season 2. But still, it was great. The acting was funny. It, what it is, what what uh, Joey O created was basically a um, a uh, comedy, a comedy and dramatic series called Pony Meets World. It was great. I loved it. Um, the acting was nice. Um, the lighting was perfect. It was it was awesome. And um, yeah. He was uh, he was very creative and and uh, everything. And when he found out that he had um, cancer, that still didn't let him go. He he just kept on going. Um, that's what basically inspired me. Is basically he when he uh, got out of the hospital from his uh, issue, he um, he got back on his legs, got back on his feet, and he started creating more things. Like, uh, there's, there's other series, the, uh, what is this called again? Something Drum, the Pelican Drum or something. Uh, <laughs> brain fart. <laughs> Sorry, Joey O. Um, okay, let's just say those mask guys that, that are in the game or something, or whatever you want to call it, like, nah, I don't know. Um, and then, then do, and he's probably gonna be doing some zombie movie, zombie episodes too, which I can't wait to see. I hope he does do a Halloween special. Yeah, yeah, special, uh, special. I hope he does a uh, Halloween special. Uh, I I messed up that word again. Come on, special this month. Um. But I know, I know my, uh, I know that's uh, gonna be like still kind of. I know I'm basically asking a little too much, but if he does, that'd be great. I'll, I'll be, I'll be uh, all for it. I would love, I would love to see it, see his uh, special if he does uh, make. Um, and I, and good thing too, I'm off on Halloween, on Halloween. So, yeah, it's my day off on my favorite holiday. Yeah, yeah. Halloween's my favorite holiday. Not everyone likes Christmas. Just saying. <laughs> I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I love spending time with my family. I love spending time with friends, and I love gift gifting. I love giving gifts to people. I love celebrating, celebrating the holiday. I just, it's just not my favorite. Christmas is not my favorite. Halloween is. That's like basically it. <laughs> Reason why I like Halloween is basically it gets me uh, gets me uh, pumped up, and I get to create more things, and I could create sc scary things, creepy things, funny things. Oh man. <laughs> but I am gonna be uh, doing some scary. Scary videos uh, this month too for October. So uh, yeah. So uh, yeah. I'm probably gonna try to uh, try not to be scared challenge probably. Probably for the whole month probably. And yes, I am gonna be doing a gameplay. I'm doing. I'm gonna be doing some gameplays and doing a series too. So that that that's that's one thing. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Before I go, I'll show you guys the poster. <sighs> this is the poster I created. This is the title of it. Here's Sam. Here's Sam on the left side. Sam and Centauri. The Protectors of Sazville. Then Centauri's on the right, holding up, holding up the sign. Then here's Sam with his uh, with his super warrior mode. And yes, and yes, 
uh, the characters the characters in this uh, series are gonna have super warrior modes like how Spartan Larry has super Spartan mode and General Saz has uh, has uh, super assassin mode and and uh, Mike once has super forge mode <laughs> which is great and then um, there's uh, Centauri in her super uh, warrior mode she has a shield and a sword that glows yeah that's um, that's a glowing sword it, what it is is basically that's energy that's coming out of the sword um, if you guys ever watch uh, like Naruto or any kind of anime energy coming from swords you know it helps people attack from distances and stuff which is really cool and yes I even signed it too so yeah I'm thinking about putting this into a frame and painting it up on my wall so that way every time when I make a video you guys will keep on seeing this all the time uh, so yeah um so when we start talk before I go about the uh, Saz and and uh, Saz and um, Mike once so General Saz he's from the from the world of Creed uh, from the Creed universe um, he was uh, he was one of he's, he's one of the he is one of the um, warrior one of the uh, super warrior trio um, and then there's uh, Spartan Larry he's from the Spartan he's from the uh, well he's from the Spartan division from the from the Halo world and then there's uh, Mike Wunsch, Mike Wunsch the Fortnite, aka, um, and yes, he's a uh, he's a knight, he's a knight, and um, he has a blaster and a sword. I mean, come on, it's a uh, 21st century. You can't always have swords. You gotta have something. I mean, unless it's if it's one of those anime anime swords. That's what he also has too. He has an anime sword too, but he also has a blaster. Hey. <laughs> but uh yeah. Um so um so um Mike wants he's a forger, he makes a, he could build he could build basically anything out out of every he could base he could basically build everything out of basically anything. John Zaz, he's basically a, an, an assassin. He was trained by Master Ezio. Well, all three of them were trained by Master Ezio himself. Master Ezio trained Spartan Larrys, uh, John Zaz, and and um, Mike uh, Mike once. When he uh, after he trained them, they became the the Super Warrior Trio, and. Um, They've been like a like a powerful icon during the uh, powerful icon through the through the through the multiverse <laughs> ever since. Um, so yeah. Um. <clears throat> that's basically it for right now. If you're wondering, if you're wondering what that noise is coming from, yeah, that's what the noise was coming from. Scratching on my bed, pulling fleas on my bed. Damn dog. Hey, hey, hey. Are you done? Oh come on. Eh. Eh. Okay, fine. Be an asshole. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you guys later. This is um. If you like this video, please put a like. If you have any questions or concerns, please comment down there below. And if you want to see more of my videos in the future, please subscribe. This is Larry, and I'm out. <laughs>